All right. We'll see if this works. Let's see if anything works here. Hopefully it does. Yeah, looks like it is. Awesome. Settings should be okay here. And audio mix is good and all that as well. Very nice indeed. That's what we like to see. Alright. Let's we'll wait for people to show up. See if they're what up, Baggy Saurus. How you doing? See if this uh, updates in real time. So check it out, guys. We're on uh, the new setup over here, and I have it set up to stream. So we're going to try it out for the voice time. And we're going to uh, do some trucking across Texas and get used to Texas because I haven't driven very much of it. So I was going to play it, and I was like, you know what? I might as well figure this out and set it all up. I got another monitor over here on the left so I can see the chat. No problem. Happy New Year to all of you. How you doing? Nardi, what's up? How you doing? Good day to you. The mic isn't as good. Well, yeah. I mean, it's a headset, man. See? It's a headset. It's not my uh, beautiful RE20, but hey, you know, it'll work. Well, let's give it a shot, shall we? Uh, let me know how this truck sound is compared to the, the music and all that stuff, because this is a balancing act we're going to have to learn together. But I got the big cam 400 uh, in this bad boy. And uh, it sounds so good, man. Uh, this is the FLD. Uh, I think it's CGO. It's Harvin and CGO, but I think it was CGO. But it's on the workstop, uh, workshop, the Steam Workshop. So, yeah, it's an old FLD. Uh, and it's got five-inch pipes on her. And listen to this thing. Love that sound. Roll our windows down. Hear it more. Yeah, Z Mod's awesome, uh, awesome big cam engine pack is in it. Got the 13 speed in this bad boy. Oh, I had a good weekend, man. I had a really good weekend. How's the truck sound compared to like music and stuff? That pretty good in my voice. Pretty balanced. Did I do a good job? I think I might have done a good job on it. So we get ourselves a job, actually. We're here at the uh, place. And I haven't done that. Balanced? Awesome, man. Glad I saw it. All right, sweet. Let's, um, uh, let's get ourselves a job in the freight market here. Because we're in uh, Lufkin. And I really would love to go to like our Laredo. That would be fun. Pick a knuckle boom loader. Oh, yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's get rocking and rolling. I'm used to the 18 speed, so I might, it might take a little bit for right. me to get used to and the 13, third, but right. that's okay. And I'm not using track IR just for everybody's sake of uh, not right. getting sick for the first time. Put that in gear, right? Gear, are we in? We're in second, okay. Get ready to turn left. We'll make it a left right here. But yeah, let me know if the music's too loud or what's going on. Because it's certain songs are gonna be louder than the others. You know what I mean? So that's okay. Ready. Turn left. Listen to this engine brake. <laughs> Stromer, what is going on, man? Good to see you. Hopefully you're doing well, dude. Looks like the rain's coming down. Damn, already? Let's roll our windows up. We're floating these. Uh, music's a little loud. 
Okay, hold on. Let me do that. Ah, nobody like you. There we go. That should be much better. We dropped it a whole like 13, 12 there. <laughs> but yeah, I love the sound of the truck too, but you just, you wanna have like that sound of like, you know, music in the background. That's how I usually play this game. All right, let's do it. So we're floating these gears. You can even skip gears if you want. It's a smooth engine though. Much better. We got the motion platform V3. I turned it up a little bit more so you'll see me moving around a lot more in this than last time. Somebody's going from that way anyway, so we're all good. Oop, missed that one. Why did I miss that shift? No, that's all right. I think I was trying to skip too much there. <laughs> Get ready to turn left. Yep, free on the workshop. This FLD is, and it's it's really well done, man. And then really do left. like it. This rain shower shouldn't last turn that long. Right. Technically, it shouldn't. We're in Lufkin, Texas. Right. And we're going to be going to Laredo, I believe. It looks like to me. Happy New Year to you as well, Kill King. How you doing? Listen to this bad boy. That's not so good, man. <laughs> it sounds so damn good. I'll be left here. That works for me. I'll show you the truck here while we're at the, the light, too. She is a beauty. Let's get our lights on, man, for safety. What are we doing here? It's raining. Look at that. It's that classic old uh, FLD, man. I, I love the 90s FLDs. They're awesome. I'm doing f just fine, Face Farm. How you doing tonight? We're currently bobtailing right now in Lufkin, uh, Texas, and we're picking up a load to take down to Laredo. Scoffy the Noob, thank you for the cheer. Happy New Year to you as well. Always got the Cokes. Of course, man, you got to have the Cokes. I was driving a little bit earlier, just, you know, enjoying the setup after all this, you know, time of getting it all set up. It's so good to finally be able to play it. I believe this is where we're going where <laughs> I ended last time in uh, on the on the YouTube video. So that's what town we're in. Nick 2003, thank you for the 15 months, man. Good to see you. I am doing wonderful this evening. Mm -hmm. Chad, uh, what's up? How you doing? Happy New Year. Thanks for your great karaoke. Absolutely. We had a blast doing that last night, man. That was a lot of fun. Thanks for uh, hanging out with us and doing it. And a lot of people ask all the time, why uh, why we can't uh, have those <coughs> VODs. And it's because of uh, copyright reasons. <clears throat> now I'm using SIP's uh, traffic density mod. So we have more traffic. Because man, the default traffic is just so horrible sometimes. It's so like dead. And I, you know, I just want to make sure we had it. Decent one for tonight. While we're driving around. It's good to be back in ATS, man. I love it. Uh, convoy will come down later down the road. I just didn't want to deal with people in my ears all night. That, that's what happens. That's the unfortunate thing. With convoys, everybody just can't shut up on the mic sometimes, and that's the reason why you, you, you pick and choose who you want to kind of drive with. And then everybody it never seems to know. Like the problem is, no one ever has console enabled. 
Um, so everybody's waiting for everybody constantly. And uh, you got to have a group of guys that know what they're doing. Not that we haven't had that in the past. I just uh, didn't want to deal with it tonight. You know what I mean? Especially with the first stream on this setup and this PC. This is the first time I've ever streamed on this PC. So <laughs> did not want it to do that. It can be chaotic for streams. Yes, I totally agree with you on that one. Dush them Jake Bricks in the rain there, boy. What you doing? Gonna kill somebody, lock it up. <laughs> Whoa, hello, that's a bumpy road. Whoa, hello. The, the motion platform is so much smoother on this. So much better. I, it's like, it doesn't, it's not as jolting. It's just like, it, it's just movements, you know what I mean? Yeah, what G traffic does to boom is it uh, adds traffic everywhere. It doesn't do it in a density way. Uh, it doesn't uh, care about what kind of vehicles, certain times of days, and things like that. Uh, G traffic is a good way to crash your game. Actually, if you go to G traffic three, uh, like in Texas, like Dallas, it's going to crash the game. It's a guarantee. So that's the reason why we don't do it. Woo! Getting uh, getting bounced around here a little bit. Okay, let's see where this thing's at. I think it's a big, huge, like, I don't know what it is. You know what we need to do is turn up our torque on the, uh, the, the truck. Because they added that now. Uh, detours, well, that's good. Random run events off. Um, here we go. Drive shaft torque. Oh, yeah, that's all the way down. Turn that sucker up. Oh, well, it's turn about like there. A suspension stiffness turned all the way down. Trailer and truck stability. Brake intensity is where I like it. Um, sometimes I like about right here. It can be a little bit much. Depends on the truck. But there we go. Is that what caused my crash? Yes, it was G traffic when I did that. And I replicated that crash after the the video and it did the same thing. So I ain't. That's what it was. Yeah, we're taking a knuckle boom loader down to Laredo, Texas. Yeah, we finished high on life. It was great. Uh, all the VODs are here on the channel if you missed it. Uh, we're picking up over here on the right, right? That's what it is over here? Yeah, there it is right there. Oh, okay. Oh, no biggie. We got this. on the path towards it right now. But yeah, usually I have uh, the track IR on, but man, especially when you don't have your uh, stream like uh, settings dialed in, it can be really nause nauseating for everybody watching it. So that's the reason why we're not using track IR tonight. Maybe in the future we will. All right, can't see a whole lot here, so let's go ahead and uh, get out and look. Do the old get out and look, you know? Just kill the engine? We did. Oh man, we're right on it. Look at that. It's gonna go a little bit to the left here, and we're gonna be okay. Awesome. Yeah, we killed it. I left it in gear like an idiot. <laughs> All right, let's do it. There it is, right there. I see it now. Give myself a little bit more room to get over to the left side here. This is a tight little spot to pick up. We'll go over next to these poles and we'll be okay. That's where we want to be. And I have advanced trailer coupling on, so we got to be spot on this to pick it up. I see the flag back there, so we should be all right. Did I hit it there? 
I think we missed it by a little bit. By just a little bit. Move to the right a little bit more. Let's see. Yeah, a little bit more to the right. Just about right here. Let's try this. D HUD, uh, thank you for the eight months. Appreciate that big time. Oh, I love this FLD, man. There it is. Oh, wait. Suspension height might help. Really? Let's get out and look and see what's going on. Looks like we're on it, man. No, we missed it by a little bit, didn't we? What in the hell? Oh, you know what? It's probably this truck. You probably ha can't have advanced trailer coupling on it. I didn't even think about that. So that's fine. We'll just uh, we'll we'll cheat that one a little bit. Mm -hmm. Let's uh, show blockers off. And where's it at? Advanced trailer coupling. Right there. That's probably what it is. So that's okay by me. There we go. It just sucks because with it out advanced trailer coupling, you can't do tug tests. Not a big deal. There we are, all hooked up here, looking good. Working lights, got flags back there. It's an oversized load, technically. Interesting. Well, I'm not gonna get any placards on this truck. That's okay. We'll just roll with it. Let's get on out of here. Eggaholic, thank you for the four months. Appreciate you, man. We're driving a uh, Freightliner FLD 120. Sandwiches 327, thank you for the 55 months. Happy New Year to you as well. Is the shifter so wobbly? What do you mean? That's what you want, man. You want th you want to throw on it. Big Hoss, thank you so much for the gifted uh, five subscriptions. Jay Randy, I like to sleep. Uh, boom, Joro and Caius, welcome to the stream family. How you doing? Mm -hmm. All right, let's go trucking. South, thank you for the two months. Good to see you. Strazi, um, you know, this is this is my uh, my Twitch channel, man. Anybody you see me playing games with online, they're not going to be here. And if that's who you're here for, then uh, I don't know what to tell you, man. So, no. Go ask them. Go bother them about it. I, I it's 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 every single stream we we get tons of people that say that. It, it's kind of rude, honestly, to just, like, go to somebody's stream and just talk about, or just ask about other people and what they're doing. Like, don't worry about it. You know, if you're not here to talk to the people that are here in the chat, um, then I, I don't know what to tell you. Because people that come in here and just, they say that stuff, they usually have an agenda, and it gets old. And um, whenever uh, you don't take the time to say hi to anybody or interact with the community, then it kind of... Uh, it's the reason why we're having this conversation. So there's that. <laughs> and it's the last time we're gonna go over it, so. You know, the first one of the day. All right, let's get this thing out on the road.
What's that truck doing? They have a crash or something up here? Looks like it. seven or an eight in this thing. I think this is the final gear, isn't it? Seems kind of strange. Something's off about it. Is that the normal amount of RPM we should have for a 13 speed? I don't think so, not in the final gear. That's strange. Mustafa, thank you for the raid. Hello, everybody. Welcome on in. How you doing tonight? Captain Tim, 47 months. Happy New Year to you as well. Thank you very much. They're not going. Screw them. Go straight. It might be the transmissions off. I think this is a 336. Should be pretty, uh, Pretty accurate with that. Oh no, of course it, it does have a seventh gear and eighth. It just doesn't have the splits on the top. Duh. We're fine. I was driving it right. <laughs> Didn't realize it. Cause see now we're in seven high. Yeah, we're good. They're just not split in the basement. That's the difference in that 13 that I'm not used to. Palm Dog, what's up? Thank you for the 60 months. Absolutely awesome. Thank you for all that, man. Right lane here. Low Jake's here. Get in the left lane anyway. All right. Unstoppable. What's up? How you doing? You bought that Freight Shaker XL by John Reuter. Really nice truck. It really is, man. I love that truck greatly. We're driving the uh, FLD right now. The free one you can get on the Steam Workshop. Just type in FLD 120. It'll pop up. It's the first one. Oh, my, that guy was the Ruffles truck was stopping. That was strange. Yeah, this is the Thrustmaster TGT2 uh, wheelbase. Uh, and then on AATSaccessories.com, you can get the uh, adapter. And there's an adapter for the SCI wheels like I have right here. Uh, and then we also have, uh, there's also the, the Forever Sharp, is what they're called. There's one for those as well. So you can just buy, this is a real rim. It's a real truck rim. Man, with this uh, this heavy load behind us here, we gotta be right on the money with our our braking distances. 
Looks like the rain is moving out, though, so I don't think it's made too much of a problem before too long. So look at the truck we're driving. That torque, I love how it just raises the nose up ever so slightly. That's what we're hauling right there, man. Oh, yeah, we had a lot of fun last night, man. Oop, can't find a grind it. And then turn left. Missed that one. This 13 throws me off after driving the 18 for so long. <laughs> but we're getting used to it. All right, those are the rains moving out. So that's awesome. Oh, yeah, I love the old Freightliners, man. See that torch just lift off the nose. God, that's so cool. I love it. I'm go through our gears. Oh, traffic jam up here, though. Get to yield to them, but sometimes they're nice and they'll let us in. Put the windows down here. They're gonna let us on. Look at that. Thank you for doing that. That was awesome of them. Peter belts for sure. Man, this Z mod's uh, big cam engine. I think it's the uh, select, the uh, N14 select in it. Refine on fuel, uh, full tank of that. Now we just drive to Laredo, Texas. Crossing the Trinity River. Turn our jakes up so we have that to help us stop. I did add a, a reefer sound uh, mod into it. If we do pick up a reefer, we should hear the, the reefer running. Which is gonna be cool. Hey, Dad. Sick. Oh no, man. Boy, you just can't escape it. It's been getting bad. It's been getting real bad. Everybody's getting sick, man. How about was a hangover from last night? Uh, I didn't have a hangover, believe it or not. Took care of it. I, I drank after the the stream was over. We uh, we stopped. We were playing Jeopardy and stuff. So I just um, was drinking water and all that, and then had some ibuprofen, and then I was good. I woke up with no hangover. But I didn't drink near as much as I did the first time. That's for sure.
towards right. San Antonio. That's what we want. So this is the town of uh, Houston. That's where we're at right now. Houston, we have a problem. Hey, Polar Freezy, how you doing? How you feeling today? I know everybody asks me that all the time. I wasn't the only one drinking last night. It was New Year's. We, and we always drink responsibly. I mean, it's not like uh, we're being stupid. Shouldn't be going north. We should just have to stay in this lane, I would imagine. Ooh, an airplane. Look at that. Yep, just staying in this lane right here. Dark Knight Ninja, thank you so much for the seven months. Good to see you. Hey, James, what's up? Happy New Year to you. Welcome on in. Oh man, the turbo on this one sounds so good. I must say, I like it. I look at the log. See that little car there? He sees me though. We're coming over. Happy New Year to you, Jinxie. You had six beers and two vodka shots? Oh, man. Oh, vodka shots. Ugh. No vodka for me. Getting over before it gets crazy. Look, they're going to have a lane shut down here. Yeah, it's going to be a 55 mile an hour zone. Work zone. Yeah, Yingling Hershey's chocolate. Oh, I've had that before. That thing's way too sweet for me, though. Like, I like uh, chocolate milk stouts and things like that. But uh, the Hershey's uh, Porter is very, from Yingling very sweet. It tasted good, though. I did, I've had it before. Uh, I like beer and wine. I don't. I don't drink a lot of hard alcohol at all, man. We're gonna have to stop the CMV. Almost a guarantee. Yep, we gotta stop. this one it is this one this one always throws me off just a little bit uh, my favorite wine is Chianti that's what I was having last night good old Chianti man Z Jackson thank you for gifting uh, or sorry thank you for Hold on a second, let me do this all at once. Three month gifts are uh, entered in month two, because Mech Auto got you three. I got you. What's up, man? Well, always good to see you. All right, let's say hello to this person. Hey, how's it going? Good? Nope, oh, a little bit further. 52, 864. We're not that bad, actually. All right, I'm gonna go through all the gears here and uh, keep the windows rolled down so you can listen to it all.
here's the final gear right there. We used every one of our gears to get it back up to speed. Pretty awesome. Man, I can't see anything at night in here with this. Uh, I might have to turn off that light in here at night. That sucks. Because I can't see anything. Well, I mean, it's hard to say. Let's roll these windows back up. Now we're just cruising down the road, man. Engine brake on in case we need it to stop abruptly. Yep, drive the Freightliner FLD. 120. You guys are going slow, man. It gets really dark on this monitor uh, at night. It crushes the blacks pretty darn good. I see what you guys see on the stream, which is a lot brighter than what I see. <laughs> but if the light was off in here, I'd be able to see a little bit better. Yeah, this mod as well. Yeah, man, it's a free mod, uh, free truck. You cannot go wrong. It is great. Well done. Uh, this paired with the, uh, you know, Z's big cam custom, uh, Cummins hits. It's a, it's a match made in heaven. Very, very good. Live in Houston, you've driven all these highways. Yeah, ATS does a great job of capturing the areas, man. Making it feel like it. Nice to drive a Freightliner M2 box truck at work. Nice, only one. Always love to look at these things. I have the five inch uh, pipe mod on it. So there's two versions. There's a five and then an eight. So yeah, it can get even louder than this. But they're going slow, aren't they? Get over. I know this car doesn't want to let me over, but I'm coming over, buddy. That guy pulling doubles there is slow. Yeah, this guy's got the right idea. This truck in front of us, he's going, uh, he's going about as fast as he needs to. He's doing the actual speed limit. These guys on the right were not. That's pretty realistic, though. Oh yeah, road work ahead. Just that's what we need. Is he getting off the highway? He might be. Yeah, he is. Okay. San Antonio, everybody. So, Carl, thank you for the subscription. Welcome to the stream, family. How are you doing tonight? Happy New Year to you. We had a good one. I'm doing great, Iceman. How you doing? Uh, Anoximus. A lot of people didn't watch that whole video because I, I, in in the middle of the video, we switched it back over to mile per hour, not kilometers. I knew what the issue was. It was because of the profile I had downloaded for it. But a lot of people were saying stuff that was in there, and then I was like, well, I mean, we did it in the middle of the, of the game or in the middle of the video, but a lot of people didn't watch the whole thing through. So yeah, it's been fixed for a while. Hey, absolutely, Sir Carl. I appreciate it, man. Good to see you tonight. Sixty-five here. Oops. 
We're going a little fast, aren't we? Just a little bit. Jake break on low. Uh, haul in a, I forget what the hell it's called. It's a piece of machinery. Quasar Wolf, thank you for the 30 months. Appreciate you. Good to see you. Uh, there's a lot of traffic in the game. We saw You saw it earlier, um, but uh, this is using SIP's awesome traffic density mod. So when you're rolling in the middle of the night, right. Uh, it's 11.37 p.m. Right. You're not going to have a lot of traffic. And that's exactly what's happening here. Turn right. Oh, we want the left side right, though, right? Yeah. We want El Paso. Keep left. I'm doing good, Quasar. How are you doing tonight? I mean, yeah, Tim, I, I, I'd be able to drive a lot better if I wasn't reading chat, but it is what it is, man. That, we're, we're, we're streaming. You know? I'm not going to not talk to y'all. <laughs> There's not a list of mods. Uh, if you want to see what mods I'm running, um, besides this truck, I added this truck, but uh, if you want to see it, it was the end of my last YouTube video on it. Yeah, whenever I'm not streaming or anything like that, when I'm driving, yeah, it's a lot better. I rarely drive off the, off the lanes. But yeah, the traffic density mod makes it to where in the middle of the night you don't have a lot of traffic. That's what I was getting at earlier. Okay, now we're back in the 70 zone. The bypass, all right. We don't have to stop the scale house. That's always nice, you know. Oh, there are parts of Texas that are 80 miles an hour in the game, especially up north-west. Uh, 57 miles to Laredo, so we're getting close. Uh, 85 on a big rig? Oh, yeah. If you're if you're hauling uh, hauling cattle, man, if you're a bull hauler, you're, be, you're doing 80, 85 at night, straight up. No governor. Yeah, this is the thing I love about SIP's uh, traffic is that, and I forgot to reinstall it last time I did a video, um, but I love the fact that at night you don't have to deal with near as much traffic during the day. You have 
you know, a lot more and gridlocks and traffic jams and stuff like that. It's really cool. It's well done. And I think this is the best version he's ever made. Easily. Stop the yellow rest area. Sal County safety rest area. Look at that. Very cool. Go straight. Oh, they have it where you can turn to the right, I guess. How do they have this? Yeah, I guess that's what they're doing. Oh, says you, oh you can't park there. Okay, you have to park over this way. I thought that was right. It's like most rest areas, you go to the right and then you pull left. You know what I mean? Have ever driven a semi truck in real life? No. Have not. break here and go to the bathroom and stuff. I'm going to turn the lights off here since it's nighttime. We're still doing our thing. You know what I mean? So let me hit the bathroom and uh, I'll turn the light off in here so we can truck a little bit better. I'll be right back, folks. Uh, this truck actually does have the ability to have an interior light. I turned it off, though. But, yeah, you can have an interior light on this one. Keep moving up. All right. I can see much better at night now with the lights off in here. Seat. There we go. 
about right there. Breggy. Oh, Blue Eye Tom, I'm loving Texas, man. Well, well done. setting of Jake and then this is the second one and then the lowest one is this one pretty good real good stuff man uh, I am not hungover no feel pretty darn good got some pizza and salad earlier it was wonderful got a lot of sleep Lord Hostile, thank you so much for getting a subscription to Missouri Sky. Missouri, welcome on in. The stream family. Roll our windows up. We don't need those on blast, do we? No, we don't. Oh, yeah, I see way better now with that white light turned off in the room. Hey, rookie, what's up, man? Good to see you. Thanks for gifting one out, brother. Get the one out to Schnookums. Schnookums, Schnookums. welcome uh, to the stream family. Big thanks to rookie for doing that. Appreciate you, man. Andrew, thank you for the 30 months. Good to see you. How you doing? Did you have a good uh, New Year's? <laughs> I really need to change my Twitch name. Twitch name. Work through the holidays again? Oh, man. I'm sorry to hear that. I worked at the airport ramp. That's That was every Christmas and New Year's, you name it. Right. And then Thanksgiving. Right. Worked them all. Okay, exit right. Okay. So... We're outside of Carriza Springs in Uvalde, so we're going to be exiting here. Turn left. Turn left. And, uh, well, that, and then also, if you tell people where you get your uh, AI traffic mods, they don't know how to use a computer correctly or the internet these days, and uh, they end up getting a virus or something because they don't have. They download, you know, something that says download.exe and they run that. And I mean, <laughs> the hand holding is a thing that we just you just can't do. There's so many great guides out there on YouTube and stuff on how to install mods and stuff. But the first thing is, if you're going to be installing mods into this game, you, you, number one, have to know how to use the internet properly. And that is not clicking on everything that pops up in front of your face. A lot of the free uh, mod or free uh, file hosting sites have that kind of crap on them. So if you're not aware of that, You might be better off buying, like, uh, paid mods and official mods, you know what I mean? More than likely. Hey, 
Go left turn coming up here. Get ready to turn left. No such thing as free lunch. <laughs> no, pretty much. Union Pacific. Turn right. There's a truck coming. I was about to turn my. We have lighting now. I turn my bright lights on there for a minute. Pretty much, Sir Caro. That's just how it is, man. And uh, I get people all the time in my comments on my ATS videos blaming me for those things. So when that started happening, I was just like, you know what? No. I'll show you the mods at the very end, and you can just use Google and then use, uh, use your uh, common sense. Installing mods in this game is very, very, very easy. It's a simple process. You download the mod, you put it in your My Documents folder, American Truck Sim, in a mod folder. If you don't have a mod folder, you have to create one. Uh, and then, apart from there, are they going to let me through here? Let me look closer. Yeah, there it goes. Another window down here. Okay, we're in the yard now. <laughs> Mods are easy to find, man. You just literally Google. Very easy. You go to the another one is go to the SCS forums. There's media fire uh, downloads that people do for that. So. You should always be using those anyway. I, I, I only use ATSmods.lt uh, if I'm going to download a Jazzy Cat mod because that's the only place that they ha host them. Um, but for all my other mods, no. I'll, I'll go to SES forums and download that. If you literally type in Google ATS and then what you're looking for, you're going to find it. A lot, of the, uh, a lot of those mod sites, their uh, SEO is actually really well done. You find it all the time. All right. Hazard's on in our yard. I'm not sure where this thing goes. About to find out. But it's around the corner, it looks like. I don't think I can get through here. Hmm. It's got to be on the other side. It's okay. We'll just back up. And we'll make a left... It's got to be on the other side back there. Bring it on tonight. We're driving the FLD 120. It's a free mod on the Steam Workshop. That's another thing is uh, if you're getting new into mods, uh, just go on the Steam Workshop and get all your mods there. Then you're, you're bypassing all the hard stuff, if you consider it hard. Great variety of stuff. Great things there. A lot of good ones. A lot of must-have mods and all that are there. Okay, it's got to be back here on the right somewhere. Make sure we don't hit that yard dog. We're good. All right, let's get out. We'll walk over there and see where they want this thing at. And then uh, we can have a game plan here. So to do this, you have to have the console enabled. Um, so you, you you go dev console equals one in the uh, in your my documents uh, config folder for America Truck Sim. So my documents America Truck Simulator in the config folder there. Uh, you open that up and you're looking for G U use G set or something like that. Uh, the console one and then also uh, there's another one. It's like developer console and then there's something else console. But you, there's two of them. You have to change the zeros to one. And then you can hit the tilde key, and you see that, the console down there? 
you can use that. Um, so what we do is when we have console avail available to us, we can now fly. So we just hit uh, the zero key and then you're here and then you use your numpad keys to move around and the middle mouse wheel is how you fast you go. So you can go faster, slower, whatever. Okay, this is where they want it, right over here. So they wanted it to be a blind back, but we don't have to do that. We already know this is where they want this thing, right here. And our truck's over here. So we can just make the left and we'll be set up to back it on in. Look how beautiful that truck looks though. Whew. She is gorgeous. Do I have my head set on backwards? Maybe? Yes? No? Maybe? I can't tell if it's in stereo or not. Let's see. Okay, now it's right. Yeah, it was on backwards. This uh, this headset does not have a L LR on it, so you just kind of had to go with what you had. There we go. Ba -ba -bum -ba -ba -ba. Claire Snipes, Talson, try that A330 Neo. You recommended me in OCRP chat. Oh, nice. Yeah, they fixed it. Yeah, I know they've been working on that a lot, so pretty cool. Yeah, blue eye Tom, exactly. You can do that as well, which is always nice, but sometimes that doesn't happen. Okay. So we, now we already know we get, we're already gonna be set up for our back. So we're just gonna go to the left here. Although sometimes they screw you. Oh, they're not gonna let me do it, are they? They're gonna have an invisible wall here, aren't they? I really don't like how SCS does this sometimes, but we'll see if they did. Ooh, looks like they're gonna let me use it. Okay, I'm not gonna push my luck, but I know sometimes it doesn't. Doesn't like when you do that, you know? We need to cut this thing all the way this way. Yeah, they have that, they, yeah, they have that stupid yard dog over there. Let's pull our trailer to the right more. They put things in certain spots on purpose, so you hit it. <laughs> so you have to be more careful. <coughs> but you can see the uh, yard dog back there. That's what I'm trying to avoid hitting. I got my nose mirrors on the right. Helps out a lot, so I don't have to look all the way over to the right. Here we go. This is when we move the trailer to the right now around that yard dog. Should be good. All right. There we go. Got the window. Yeah, that's what I didn't want to hit was that yard dog. And they were trying to do it. Invisible walls do hurt your truck, yes. That's why it says in the options, be uh, be careful when disabling this because of those reasons.
we should be straight in there now. Alright. There it is. Go ahead and drop it. So what I will be doing is um, with the other profile, this is my YouTube profile, but uh, with the other profile, I start, I have to start, I'm starting from scratch on it. So we're going to be using that when we stream next time. I, say, I have to save up money and get a decent truck and then we can start off with that. But it'll be fun. Give us something to do, something different, you know? Uh, Lord Hostile, no, I have not. It's a lot of American trucks in, man. What's up, Tate Ben? How you doing? <clears throat> All right, let's see. Current company job offers. We're just exploring Texas. Go to Dallas with furniture. Oh. We just went through that, didn't we? Yeah, we cut over and then we went down. I want something off this way. We haven't been over here towards here. El Paso or something. Uh, Bozeman, Montana. <laughs> That's a long drive. Should we do it? Who thinks we should do the talc powder to uh, to Bozeman, Montana? Let's do it. Blue this one right there. All right. We're going to see a lot of highway. It's going to be a, lo a long run. That'll be fun. Pick it up over here on the left. on the other side, isn't it? One of those trailers. There it is. It's over there. Okay. Well, now we know where we're going. We're going to long haul it, man. We've attached it. Oh, that looks awesome right there. Let's get a picture of this. All looking pretty. We'll make a, we'll change the time of day and all that. That's pretty cool looking. I like it. Get a little closer in. Not bad. Pretty cool. 
All right, long haul to Bozeman, Montana, everybody. We got uh, three quarters of a tank of fuel, so we'll have to get some later on down the road. But other than that, man, we're, we're golden. We're uh, ready to go go do this thing. We're driving the uh, Freightliner FLD 120. Get it on the Steam Workshop. Just type in FLD 120, pops it right up. Can't go wrong with it. It's really well done. Here we go. You used to own a purple 91 FLD, D Brown. Nice. I love the look of these things. What is this guy doing? They can't figure their life out, can they? They're blocking traffic's what they're doing. I guess they go around them on the grass. Oh, this truck is trying to figure it out, and they're not doing it. See, the moment I go to the right is whenever they're all going to screw up here. I have a feeling. Yep, I use a adapter for this on ATSAccessories.com. You can get an adapter that'll work for the uh, SEI wheels for the Thrustmaster wheel I have. Yeah, we're just gonna skate by on the right of this guy here. It's gonna be tight, but we'll be all right. This stupid dude right here, man, causing all these issues for everybody. What are you doing, dude? Move. And now you have the Isuzu trying to figure his life out. What are you morons doing? Holy moly, dude. The moment we try to go around this guy, this is when this idiot does this. Go. Move your stupid truck, dude. The moment we went around this guy, that's when this jackass decides to back up in front of us. There you go. Move your stupid. Here, I'm gonna turn my uh, hazards off. Maybe that's freaking them out. Should have made this decision a little earlier. And now we're dealing with this idiot. Can we get out here on the left? Nope. This is unbelievable. I'm kind of perplexed at what he's doing. He was just moving it a second ago, and now he's not going to move it. Yeah, I'll have to clear the traffic. It's just a pain in the ass. Yep, we gotta load it now.
I'm not going to do it in the console because that's going to break the whole traffic flow. This is going to break the mod that I'm running traffic with, which is C uh, SIPs. You don't want to mess with things traffic-wise in the console when you're running um, traffic mods. It's bad. Yeah, you'll get a game crash or something stupid will happen. Because that mod... Um, is utilizing the default traffic everything from it, SES. All right, let's get on out of here. We figured it out now, right? Yes, we did. <laughs> Anytime you're messing with traffic settings in the console, you, you can, it's almost, for me, it's, I always get a game crash out of it somewhere down the line. I tried uh, Meatballs mod again, and man, oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> That's how you lose all your frames. I think Sips is the best one that you can get easily. Train coming. They really don't want us getting anywhere, do they? Not today. <coughs> turn right. We're going to turn right. We are, we are. Anonymous Gifter, thank you for doing that. Gift the one out to Frankie there. Frankie. Welcome to the stream, family. How you doing tonight? To oh, left. my bad. I'm supposed to yield to everybody coming off the highway there. Read and chat. Gonna get ourselves killed right out of the gate. <laughs> we don't have a stop sign. Look at that. It's rare. Get ready. All right, Dad. Hopefully you feel better. Love you. Get some rest. We're off to Bozeman, Montana, out of Laredo, Texas. This is going to be a long drive, y'all. Long drive. Throw our windows up. But we're trucking now. station Let's see maybe we'll be okay nope it's closed perfect though forty five through here though Mm 
coming back to 75. Oh, the setup's amazing. Yes, it is fantastic. Got a long drive ahead of ourselves here today. Anybody pay attention to what we're hauling? I don't know. I never care. That's the thing. I don't ever care what we're Wait, we got. Talc powder. That's what it is. Go to Bozeman, Montana, out of Laredo, Texas. There'll be a lot of highway driving. Hey Shane, what's up? I'm doing good. How you doing? It's gonna be a long haul right. in the FLD. We're gonna have to refuel many times on this one. We're just about a half tank of fuel right now. Some Taco Bell. Anybody need any Taco Bell? We have to get out of uh, Laredo first. Well, as I was walking the streets of Laredo. Starbucks there too. Need something from Starbucks. Why is that not going into gear? What is your problem? Oh, cause you're down. Not. Why are you doing that? Go straight. You should be in this. That gear there. There we go. Whenever you get in menus, it forgets the uh, stuff sometimes. They still haven't fixed that, though. So if you're in a gear in America Truck Sim, and then you go to like any like menu or something like that, it forgets what gear it's in, and it starts it over. You have to like, reflip the switch. So I have to go back down to first gear here. We'll be okay. Boom. Man, I haven't had Taco Bell in forever. What the hell's a Cholito? And a beef Mexi Melt. I've heard of the Mexi Melts, but now a Cholito. What the hell is that? Is that even a thing they have? Look at that guy over there mowing grass. See him? On the left? Oh, look at that torque. That nose of the truck. So good. I don't know if I we could beat this truck, but it's not going to happen. This car is going to cut into Jaguar, the XJ6 or something. Renamed Chili Cheese Burrito and later discontinued. Yeah, I don't know what Chili Cheese Burrito is. I've never heard it called a Chilito, ever. We've got a Texas uh, State Trooper behind us. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm not getting a ticket from that cop. I know he wants it. 
Be right back there. Keep right. And then go so through. easy to speed through the, the little towns. Go straight. Oh, yeah. This is just like real life. A lot of people can't figure out a four-way stop. I don't know whose turn it is. So it would be the truck. It's either the left one or the right one to go first. So they need to go. It's probably the big truck on the left. Why are you not going, buddy? Covenant. Okay. Nobody's going. Then we're going to go. I'm not sure what that's about, but all right, buddy. Like I said, just like in real life, no one knows how to do it. Why would I? It will not go into third gear. When I try to skip that. Doesn't like it. Uvalde is uh, 28 miles. Go straight. Seventy through here, we're, we're all right. We'll, get her, we'll, we'll wind her up to seventy. We'll be getting on the interstate soon enough once we get out of here. And it's just going to be a lot of highway driving until we get up to forty-four or whatever, and then probably over to twenty-five to go north. I would imagine that's what we're doing. Viewpoint. How cool. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. I don't know what the hell some of you guys are talking about. I'm just I'm just ignoring any of the trolley nonsense. It's all good. That fire truck does look good, doesn't it? It's got the Roadmasters on it. Thank you, Alex, for taking care of the uh, taking the trash out last night. Appreciate it, and today. <laughs> kind of you. Let's see, we skip the gear here. There it is. It's like time it just right. Why are they getting in this lane and then they got to get over? That makes no sense. All right, this car's going to let us over, though. Thank you, buddy. I don't know what these people are doing. <laughs> Noah, what's up? How you doing, man? Good to see you. Happy New Year to you. We're not headed for Atlanta. We're going to Bozeman, Montana. We we're leave. We just left Laredo, Texas. So if that tells you where we're at, that's what we got going on. We do, we do.
Joke, thank you for the two months. Appreciate it. Good to see you. Hopefully you're having a good New Year's Day. A lot of people are staying indoors and like nothing open on New Year's Day usually. But nothing to really to do. Car, car, car. Wow. Right out of the gate, already an idiot just pulling out in front of us, tried to get killed. Didn't even hit the brakes, and didn't even stop at the stop sign at all. Just ran straight through it. That was interesting. Not sure how sharp of a turn this was. I think the next one's gonna be harder than this. Try to get a run up the hill here. Super slow. There's the jerk that nearly got killed. Oh man, you are going slow, aren't you, bud? Island Mac, thank you for the three months. Good to see you. Oh, thank you, Chad. I appreciate you. Hey, gaming man, what's up, man? Uh, I try not to talk about any of that stuff, uh, any personal stuff like that. A lot of people get really opinionated about everything, and it's just not even worth opening the can of worms, to be honest with you, but I do appreciate you asking. When people want to know certain information so they can try to find certain information about something else, uh, there's a, usually a whole to-do about it. No, you're, you're fine. You didn't do anything wrong. You did nothing wrong. I do want to get it. Oh, he's getting over too because his lane ends. We don't have any choice. Why are we hitting brakes? So oh, we got a light up here. Okay. such a small trailer and truck in front of us here man he's he's pretty slow not very not very uh, quick at all gotta say uh, Stolid that's not what it's a that's not what that is for man it's for GTA characters that we do in like RP I'm I'm about to remove that one honestly. It gets it gets dumb sometimes. And usually half the people that do it don't uh, don't know what it is. But I appreciate you. Watching. Tar snakes. That looks awesome. Alex, thank you for the patience you have as a saint. I don't know how you're doing it right now, man. There's a few I'd be shutting up currently. <laughs> but thank you for always having our back. You know it. You know exactly what I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
All right, we're on the interstate now. Might be able to relax a little bit. Nope, we gotta get off the highway now. Damn. Not on the not on the main interstate yet, but see, look at this. I told you there's some highways here in Texas that are 80 mile an hour. This one is one of them. So we're getting off right. the highway. And then exit right. So they're cutting us over, it looks like. I'm not sure which way they're gonna have us go. It's kinda interesting. Exit right. Get ready to turn. Is that FLD 120 Freightliner FLD 120? This bad boy right here, and we are uh, driving it all night, not changing trucks. It's free on the Steam Workshop. Just look up FLD 120, and it'll pop right up, it's like CSG or something. CSG and Harvin worked on it together. Although I think everybody just calls it the Harvin truck, but it's a Harvin truck, but it's not. That is incorrect. Oh, it's amazing for a free truck, yeah, I agree. I need some texture work for sure, but not bad. I'm enjoying it. There's a Texas State Trooper. Man, like foggy out almost, it's like overcast and a little bit of haze. Happy New Year to you as well, John. John, how you doing? Little picnic area there. That's cool. Yeah, I usually try to pick the, uh, the wheels that match the one I really have in real life. This is a this is a real truck uh, rim wheel that I'm using. That LFD on that thing is terrible. I see that all the time. Oh, that's cool. I got an actual like road construction that does that. I wasn't sure what they were doing. You gonna play some Overwatch, baby? Oh, you don't have to be quiet. Are you uh, gonna play Overwatch? Nice. I took a run. We're Laredo, Texas, and we're going to Bozeman, Montana. So it's gonna be a long drive. <laughs> All right, I love you. Oh, baby, can you open that door and leave it open? Thank you. It's getting warm in here. <laughs> it's very hot in here. Added a, yet another monitor to the whole mix. Now I have one, two, three, four, three, four, five. There's five monitors in this room now. It puts some heat off, man.
Okay, we're good now. Jinxy Blue, thank you for the cheer. Appreciate you. Hey, thank you, Aviation King. Appreciate you. The kind words. Act up, get smacked. What's up? Start off the new year good with my first stream. All right. Well, welcome on in. Happy New Year's Day to you. Hope it's been a good one for you. Costa Rica. Favera. What's up? How you doing? stop at a truck stop once we uh, get out of this a little bit because we're almost to the highway it looks like Not, uh, not out of this yet, man. I don't know when we're getting on the highway. I don't know how they're uh, root, rooting us on this one. Why did that car hit the brakes in the middle of his turn to the right? That was strange. That was weird. Something going on up here for the highway. No, I have three monitors on my main setup over there, and then I have uh, the 48 inch monitor in front of me right here, and then I've got a 32 on the left for the chat and OBS and all that stuff. something here. That was the uh, end of a lane there. And I couldn't figure it out. Yeah, I'll let that big truck go if he wants to. There you go, buddy. You got it. Go straight. So we are 52 miles outside of Abilene. I'm trying to figure out which way they're they're taking us here. Pretty interesting. We're on 83 going north. So yeah, we're gonna go all the way up there till we hit the main highway. It looks like that's how they're gonna do it. That'll work. We're driving a uh, Freightliner FLD 120. Go straight. It's free on the Steam Workshop. Just look up FLD 120 and it pops right up. It looks like this. Right there. Oh my god. Yep. 
That's why I don't do it. Third person. It's a good way to get in crashes. Kill yourself. And I'm not using a track IR. That way no one gets sick from all the movement. Man, I'm pretty happy with what the uh, the stream looks like. It looks pretty darn good from what I can see for you guys. Looks pretty smooth. Abilene, we got an achievement. Go medium Jake break. I'm not huge into cab overs. I have a Peterbilt 362 by John Ruta. It's, it's awesome. Don't get me wrong. I'm not huge into them. Yeah, we'll do convoys later down the road. Not tonight. Yep, I have the latest version of his uh, Ram pickup. He's added a lot of stuff to it, Benji. It looks awesome. A cab over is like a flat nose truck. Save a little bit of fuel. Got to be out of that gear. Um, we can always turn on snow. Once we get up a little further north, we can turn the winter on. So we, we do it at the Colorado State Line. You think that would be good? We turn the winter on in the Colorado? I think that would be pretty decent. Then we have it all the way up to Montana. I have everything uh, linked in my recent um, YouTube video, so if you want to see, if you want to tally up all everything, you surely can. I have no interest in doing that. It's just many, many, many years of getting things, and then I have, there's some sponsored stuff as well. So it's it's hard to say how much everything costs, but it's it's not cheap to get to this level. This is something that I've always wanted to do years and years ago, and it Both finally. Great came together and then I just finished it I, literally like a couple days ago. And the next room I'll be tackling is the flight sim room. There's a big roundabout. It's like a roundabout but not a roundabout? No, it's a roundabout. Nope, that's a parking lot thing there. Okay. That's cool. Now we're going to be in non-interstate, it looks like. Go straight. Sort of making a left. So, sorry, car. I don't know what. I don't know these Texas roads yet. 
kind of all over the place. Alright, north to 83. Pick a truck. Oh, this is, yeah, we have to cross over this way. Oh, this is a mess. Who thought this was a good idea? Yeah, no. We played American Truck Sim since it came out in 2016. happening in real life by my job right now, Red Wolf. <laughs> Yeah, I'm using JBX Graphics Mod 3. Um, I wanted to use uh, Project Next Gen because you can put them together, um, but I haven't figured out at all how to buy Project Next Gen. Uh, it's a Facebook page and then he has zero information on how to buy it. It's like you, you got to know somebody that knows somebody and knows how to do it. I, I don't I don't get these guys that run these Facebook programs. It's like or these businesses and their Facebooks. It's like if you're going to do that um like have a have a store, you know? Have a website, something that makes sense to people, but like holy moly, it is so like under the radar and everybody's like treats you like an idiot if you don't know how to, you know the magic word anybody have project next gen you have to like you have to like donate and then you have to like notify them directly i i don't get it and there's no like link to a page that tells you to do it either so i don't know why it's the way it is Back to Blue Gaming, thank you for the five months, appreciate you. Shrek, thank you for the subscription. Welcome to the stream family. I agree, I sent them a PM on Facebook with a donation thing I found is weird. It's like, I, I just don't understand why they're doing it the way they're doing it. Same thing with JBX, it's just, you gotta go to the forum and it's it, it's a nightmare. Whenever I tell people how to like do it, like, I, I had to do it. I do endure the pain, and when Project Next Gen's, if I can finally get a hold of them to do that, then uh, you know I'll do it. But until then, I won't. It's not a scam page. It's just it's just back backwards of what should be done, you know. So I like to listen to country music. Yes, that's why we're listening to it right now. If I hated it, I wouldn't be listening to it. And this is an this is a epidemic sounds library. All right, after this truck, we get to go, and then it's like a huge, like kind of a strange intersection. Oh, okay, there's a car coming. Um, and then we get to go straight, so we don't have to make left, and we don't have to get into that mess of traffic that's right there with that guy with that the trucks on the back of the car, of the truck, the trailer. Um, so, all right, Capri, so yeah, pickup truck. Yeah, I love me some Brooks and Dunn. They still play together? I don't think they do, do they? We had that one break in traffic. We have one here. Finally got that break. Break me off a piece of that. Kit, cat, bar. They're back together again. Interesting. Very cool. I did not know that. All right. Guthrie's 47 and Childress is 100 miles. So we're crossing the beautiful state of Texas right now.
Uh, Texas came out like a month ago. They playing together last night on CBS. Oh, nice for New Year's Eve. Did not know that. Good for them. Carry there on the right. Sixty mile an hour zone. And it's a lower down. Yeah, I love the uh, JBX graphics mod, man. It, it just looks so damn good. It's tough to install, too. You have to, like, get the mod load order just right. I mean, he tells you how to do it. But it can be daunting. Otherwise, you just have, like, a missing skybox, and all sorts of problems can happen from a turn, buddy. Turn, turn. We're not low on fuel. We have a quarter tank. And in these things, that's a lot. Massive. We're good to see the the fuel police already active. That's why I said when we get up here to the interstate, we're gonna stop at a truck stop up there, and we'll have plenty of fuel to do it. I promise you. Oh, hello. out of nowhere. Find sitting up high helps or ruins immersion. Sitting up high? I'm I'm six three in real life, so this is what it would be like if I was sitting in the truck cab. I'm not a short dude. So when I sit in my uh, Ram, I can see straight over the nose, too. I don't know how people sit so damn low. It drives me nuts. In, uh, in the game. I like to be able to see the nose and see... Because if you're, if you're not in VR, how are you going to be able to really tell the depth, you know? And then some people like to be like smashed in the back behind the, the left side win window sill. I don't like that either. Back up to speed. I still have my RAM, yes. All right, cool guy. We'll see you after a while. Hey, Alex and Gary, what's up? Happy New Year to you. Hopefully, hopefully you're doing well. And Bob, thank you for the uh, the cheer. Appreciate you doing that. And the moment we get up, back up to speed, we gotta slow way down again for these little tiny towns. 55 mile an hour zone. Great. 
Have to stop the CMP station more than likely, which sucks because you have to turn around. Yep, oh, this is the worst one of them all. You have to turn around to go that way, we have to go back down and turn around again to get into this stupid way station because they don't want have one on the right side of the road. It's one of them kind of deals. down. They're gonna let me go? Really? Oh my heavens, look at this. Thank you! What a nightmare. Oh my god, dude. This is one of the worst ones of them all. I didn't fix the anti-aliasing. You don't you don't notice it as much as I do. Uh, it's Ever since I moved over to this 48-inch monitor, it's really it's a lot more noticeable. That's all it is. So until they fix it with uh, you know DirectX 11 or R12, it's really not much we can do. He's kind of endure it, you know. Really don't want to go in that gear, do you? Do not like that gear. Okay, so now we go down here and turn around again. What a pain in the ass. All just to, to get a way station. We got lucky though, there's no traffic right now. Perfect. We're trying to pull off our U-turn. Now we're back on the road, just like that. Roller wouldn't just back up. All right, when is it rolled up? We're good. Okay. Well, 
rest of our lives and take a ride with me. Alright, we should be on the highway for a little while now, we'll see. Let's wait until we get left up here though. Nope, it's just the curve of the road. Rest area there on the right. Done deal. Wait and see. So we're outside of something here. We're gonna be stopping at the big gas, the uh, truck stop down the road here. So we'll just get in the right lane. Yep, we're on our way to Bozeman, Montana. We're still in Texas. We haven't gotten out of Texas yet. But when we get to the uh, Colorado State line, we're going to do some mod finagling here and try to get the uh, winter. What's great about the new Grimes uh, winter weather mod is that you uh, can now have clear roads. It doesn't, put, it doesn't frost the roads over. It'll just put snow on the ground so we can still have clear roads, which is cool. Gamer bro, how you doing tonight? What's up? Yeah, the nighttime skyboxes look amazing with JBX graphics. I, I love it. And uh, some of the cities you'll see, you'll get the uh, light pollution. It looks really good. It's worth it. slamming brakes here. Whoa, dude. What are you doing? Is not an exit up here for that? Go straight. I guess we have to get ex exit here. Oh, no. Yeah, we do. Sorry, guys. My bad. And it's totally my fault. Didn't realize that we had to... Good thing that the traffic was all jacked up there and they're all happy Turn now left. nobody got hurt everybody's good big trucks going there too you would think these highway these highway systems are weird down here in texas they don't have a uh what you call it an exit for the truck stop you got to get off way early and then take the service road down that's just strange to me never seen, never seen anything like it 
do, do not enter. Rest. So wait, where do we go? Is that a what? We just screwed ourselves. We were fine the whole time, dude. There, I think there is an exit there, but the stupid thing didn't show it. Oh, that's so annoying. Okay, whatever. That truck's not gonna give me any room to do anything at all. And you know what we're gonna do? Doing that. I'm not doing that, man. I do not like these road systems. <laughs> We're getting used to them. I know the right lane ends. I want to get off the highway. That's the problem. I'm not really showing you how to do this. Yeah, we're at a damn truck stop. Shut up. Yeah, right lane must exit. I'm fine with that. That's what I want. A very confusing road system here in Texas, I'll tell you that. Keep left. We're going to the Petro. Should be it right here. Finding a new route. Okay, left turn here. <laughs> the hell is that oh you turn only good god what is this road system texas <laughs> holy crap it's terrible <laughs> what was that it was like a u-turn only lane on the far left glad i didn't fall for it but we're okay What trucks? Autos only. Trucks are the next one. There's my fuel island right there. Sweet. Go straight. See, it's so weird. Some of the fuel islands you're supposed to go this way, and some of them you don't. Some you're supposed to go the opposite way, but it looks like this is how they have this one set up, so we're gonna do it. Fuel it up. I'm gonna go to the bathroom. All right. So I'm gonna use the bathroom. Probably get another soda pop. Um, what do you want to do? You want you want to fill up? We fill up when we get back. Uh, or we can fill up now and then I can park and then go. Either way, it don't matter. Let's go ahead and get out, and we'll do it that way. Yeah, yeah we'll go ahead and fill up here with the fuel button. Oh, I didn't set the fuel button up, duh. 
That's right, we'll just do it this way. A lot of pull-throughs on that side, too. I want to park where the light is, though. Yep, right where we want to be. All right. I'm going to go use the bathroom and stuff, get a soda, and we'll get back on the road. Sound good? Be right back.
All right, folks. Ready to continue our uh, trip to Bozeman? Say hello to some of y'all. If you want to know what uh, everything I use, <coughs> that's all linked in the description of my YouTube video uh, that I just put out the other day on American Truck Sum. It's the best way to find everything. I've already done that. Montana or bust. So we're going to get to uh, Colorado State Line, and then from there, we will uh, we'll go from that to... Uh, other things here look at the map we're in Amarillo right now so we started all the way down here in Laredo we went all the way up this way and now we're in Amarillo so we're about to cut over to the 25 it looks like so we're just going to have this bit of highway to go um, which is the is 87 highway 87 through Dalhart um, and then we're going to be up here so once we get to Raton we can uh, pull over and then we will uh We'll enable the winter mod, and then we'll be uh, we'll have snow on the ground and stuff up here. Sound like an idea? Let's do it. Why do they see they have it like all all of these go in this way? It's very weird to me. Because they have the exit on a whole other side of the building. That's possible as well. No bother. Is there an exit over here or no? Hell no, there's not gonna be an exit. Why would there be? Oh, that would make way too much sense. I do not understand these places, man. So terribly built. I guess we just go out the same way we came in. Like two different ways. I don't know. We're gonna we're gonna go left here. That's all there is to it. Back on 40. The GPS will screw you. They'll try to make you go some stupid back way through Amarillo, and we're not doing that. We're going to get right back on Highway 40, and we'll be fine. The Gaming Farmer Official. Thank you for the 13 months. Bakers does appreciate you. Jay, what's up? How you doing? Well, I appreciate you watching the ads. We don't have any uh, mid-rolls, so. That's the only one you really have to watch. Finding a new route. Yeah, finding a new route. The correct route. Keep left, and then turn left. Turn left. Turn left at the light. You went out to dinner, Sakara. Where'd you Where'd you eat? Exit left. 
Back on the highway we go. You ordered Taco Bell? <laughs> How was it? This is SES, man. It's turn built into the game. Right. You just move your mouse to the right and you go into the back part of the truck. Keep right. Dumas Pampas downtown. That's a tight, tight turn, man. Jeez Louise. What is this? Stay in this lane? Oh, we're going through downtown or Amarillo. Okay, very weird. Cross under. I did not want to go through downtown Amarillo, but okay. GPS strikes again, man. Yep, we're in the FLD 120. Thank you, Gaming Farmer. thing right here. I'm not sure what they're doing. Uh, it looks like they're having us go through downtown Amarillo and then going north. That's why. Oh, this is how we get on to 287 because we're not going uh, 40 all the way out. That's why. Okay, that makes more sense now. I thought this was their way of ending 40 or something, but no. We have to take this other highway, and this is the way to it. Go straight. Oh, we have to do it. Roll the windows down. Engine brake, max. Into the tunnel we go. Oh yeah. Pretty awesome. Yeah, had to do it. Yeah, in real life you have to go through downtown to get to that highway too. Okay, there you go. So it's realistic. Very cool. It's pretty amazing. Back up. I got you in playing uh, ATS trap trucking. It's fun, man, isn't it? So relaxing and just a good time. Yeah, I think I prefer doing uh, doing the camera system this way instead of track IR for uh, for Twitch streams, you know, because I look over so much to the left. I don't know. You think? What do you guys think? You think I should try doing it without track IR for uh, for the YouTube videos too? Is it better? I like playing with the Trek IR when I'm driving. It's nice. You can just freely look around, but I don't know.
goes straight. I don't mind track IR and anything you do. Okay. McDonald's. Keep left and then turn left. Turn left. Yeah, I like to have tracking on, but I mean for for a stream it looks it's it's tough to to watch. I get it. Ambulance. Go on. Dog doing stuff, stupid stuff in here. The town of Dumas. Dalhart now. department to the left. Go straight. Mm -mm 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 -mm. The train going through. Go 
I'll see. Yeah, I need to get that mod that makes the headlights better. Go straight. Which one do you use, Jay? So I can grab it. We're going to be stopping in Raton to turn on the uh, snow anyway, so. I can always grab that off the Steam Workshop and add it. And then we I can show you guys all the mods I'm running. What's up, realistic? Uh, no. Seventy-two months. Thank you, Alex. Thank you for everything you do, man. Still need to get you um, the uh, ATC sim. We'll do that this week. Six years hype. Going all the way to the top. Yeah, I know. We, we use the Jake Brakes and it's a sim. about the uh, virtual people in their homes at night. Better day night, whoa. Realistic mod, I like talking stream. I think, or is that the name of it? Blue-Eyed Tom is not out yet, man. I have no idea when it's going to be. 70 miles to Raton, and then we're going to turn on the snow. I have written songs, yes. I have a lot of plans for this uh, this year with uh, music. A lot of plans. I don't want to have an 800 horsepower truck. This thing has 436 horsepower in it. Um, it's just a realistic thing, so. We don't need an OP truck. It's, it takes the challenge out of it, you know? 13 speed, 430. Horse, we're, I mean, we're fine. That's what we got. It wasn't even that heavy of a load. I'm not going to make it daytime. <laughs> I think it's got the 336 in it for the uh, transmission. So it's it's more than enough. Whoa. I do a slam in the brakes, said it not like that. Saturday night. Whoa. You guys don't see it near as dark as I do. On my monitor, it's it's dark, but on this on the uh, stream, 
the game itself, it's a lot lighter. Yeah, we're getting around this guy. Not doing it anymore. That's Saya. holding up everybody. Thirty four miles to return. Uh, realistic you should probably read the room uh, if you cannot do that we will do it for you coming in here and starting crap out of nowhere uh, just because you got told to stop spamming the same thing over and over um, won't go far man so just get I'm giving you that warning now because we, we have a we have great people here in this community and uh, we don't put up with people's crap so so you know. We have one rule here, and that is to respect the other people here that are in the chat. And if people can't do that, then they're simply shown the door. All right. We're going to pull in here. We're going to do it. This will probably be an easy way to get in and out. We're almost to Highway 25. Go straight. Interstate 25 is where it'll be, so works for me. Dude, there's no room back here at all. I really hope eventually we're going to get one place we can actually just, like, get pull in and pull out of it easy. No, no easy street here in American Truck Sim, man. None at all. Back in between these guys over here. Oh, come on, man. This stupid trail over to the right more.
Okay. Alright, so we're going to do all of that fun stuff. Let's do it. Hey. Okay. Go ahead and, uh, and do this thing. Bam, down. Whiskey, big blue sky. It's a hell of a time. All right, let me go to the Steam Workshop and look for the headlights mod. Wine. I am. Uh, Steam Workshop. Hell of a time. Headlights. Let's find it on me own. Realistic headlining. Realistic headlights. Version 3, that was last March 26th, 2021. Does that work for 146? No one knows. Cool. Realistic headlining. August 2nd, 2022. Burger headlining, more realistic, for 12 model of SES trucks. Oh. Can't be used with other mods. Uh, realistic headlights version 1.1. Outlaw Viper, blah, 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 blah. Nobody has it for this. It has to be for the particular vehicles. You can't just throw a mod in there to change all the headlights. It doesn't work. How we gonna do this my way? All right, let's see. Here we go. JBX. They say. In DC. Load order. Here we go. So. With the weather mods, it's end base and then those and then skybox. So nine. Just above end base for all of that. It looks like. Okay. Let's go back to it. Now, how are we gonna do this my way? All right, cool. We go to options. We go, or sorry, exit. We go to launch pad. Yeah, I want to. Yep. Mod manager. I need to find my winter ones. Here they are. Frosty Heavy Winter, Clean Roads. So Frosty and then Clean Roads, or is it Clean Roads Frosty only? Frosty Wheels. Maybe it's just, just Clean Roads. About to find out. But we need to put it just above nine. Unless that's another addition to Frosty. Really don't know. But we'll find out. Put Frosty wheels in as well. Uh, I'll be down by the wheels. How we gonna do this my way? Put it right there. There we go all our mods I'm not putting in the physics mod no it's annoying to deal with to make the road slick it doesn't do it in a realistic way it just I mean yeah it, it makes the road slicks but it's like having no brakes basically and it's terrible
So clean roads has to be is part of frosty winter. Okay. Well, let's see what this looks like. I mean, what can it possibly hoit? Okay, so, yeah, that did nothing. All right, cool. Now we know. Yep, still have the motion rig. We've been using it all night. So I get moved around. My mana job. All right, so Frosty, we're going to throw you back in there, bud. Go right below it. That right there. Mm -hmm. I don't have any place that all the mods are at now. If you want to see all the mods I was just using, I, I I go through the music at the end. I don't know. I've said it too many times, but no. Um, the truck here is is on the Steam Workshop. Grimes WordPress. That's where you're gonna find the, uh, the Frosty mod for your uh, for your weather. <sighs> I don't know. I, I've just said it so many times. I don't know. <laughs> I, I get it. Not everybody's been here the whole time. There we go. So we have snow on the ground and the roads are clear. Perfect. And we'll crank up our uh, precipitation just a little bit so we might see some snow along the way. Yeah, just a little bit. It's annoying when it's constantly snowing, you know? Um, get about right, get about right there. And we'll do random road events, turn those up a little bit. That way we might see some people having broke down side of the road and stuff. All right, I think we're good. It's all good, Glaucoma. Um, but yeah, at my last uh, ATS video I did on YouTube, if you just like look up my channel on YouTube, um, the recent one, I showed all my mods at the very end. Oh, it worked. Check it out. Truck's got the frosty uh, wheels on it and tires. I'd have to go in and change on mine, but it's all good. All right, let's do it. We're good on fuel. We're good on everything else. Get on the road. Yeah, it changes out the trucks whenever you reload the sim. Yep, see the uh, ocean rigs on. When I had the brakes, you can definitely tell. Go straight. Okay, we're getting on 25. And then it's a pretty much a straight left. shot through tw on 25 all the way through Denver and everything else. So we'll be able to actually just hang out on the highway for a little bit. Finally, that'll be nice. Oh, that looks so good though with the clear roads, the snow. Looks really good. Boy, it's always these same, uh, like Cisco or it's Saya. There's always the doubles with the small truck. They're always going slow. Oh, we have a way station coming up too. Yep, Cisco. Again, Cisco strikes again. We're getting the right 
lane because we know we're probably going to have to pull in. Let's see what the pass says. It's the next one over, I see. Way BF is slow, buddy, slow. Get around you real fast here. Free pass, come on. Give us something good. Welcome to Colorado, y'all. We did it. Got out of Texas. We got to pull in. Damn. Straight, so it's not that bad. Oh, I like the snow on the hay bales. That's cool. Why is there a car on the way station? Interesting. Okay. <laughs> I hate these auto pop-ups. There's got to be a way to turn them off. I forgot how to do it. The auto pop-ups are the worst. All right. Yeah, 78,000. I mean, it's, it's a lot heavier than the last one, but... I think we'll be okay. But now we're about to get into some uh, some fun stuff here. We'll be utilizing a lot of the engine. in talc powder Ryan talc powder lots of it too Javelin, AMC Javelin, looks like it. A little up there. Walsenberg, Alamosa. These are the old places we've been driving before. I don't think the hazard lights trick works anymore, does it? I don't think it does. Could be wrong. You always use your engine brake uh, instead of using your brakes. It's better on the truck, better, just easier on you. When you drive big trucks, uh, you don't you don't want to use the brakes that much because I mean, especially on grades and stuff, because it can get bad. We we'll go low setting on that Jake brake here, and we can just kind of maintain speed down it. We gotta get up to 75 first, so. Why 
are they slamming brakes, man? Oh, because we're getting the morning rush hour now. So see, with um, Sip's uh, awesome traffic density mod, uh, you're getting more traffic in the rush hours. So it's morning time, so we're getting that morning rush hour traffic, which is really cool. Watch out for these drivers, man. They could be crazy acting. A train coming through. Look at that. It's not a 1 to 1 scale of the US, it's a 1 to 15. Skips up here, Weblo. Holy moly! Sims working over overtime right now. These mods can be quite taxing on it, you know. No, keep that on. I've been to Colorado Springs uh, in real life. Very, very realistic area when we get up in here. Garden of the Gods and Pikes Peak and all that. Motion rig is like leaning the chair left right now on me in this turn. But at speed, man, like, look, you can move, move the chair around a lot. <laughs> All right, we've given this guy plenty of time to speed up. He's just not doing it. Colorado Springs. Wow, these guys going so slow through here. This is crazy. through all that area right there. Keep 
keeping left. I'm trying to get out of this damn truck, but man, these guys are just not driving good. Oh, we left uh, Texas a while ago. We're on our way to Bozeman, Montana. We left out of Laredo, Texas. Hence the snow. Although something's kind of strange here with the green in the snow. That is not right. Also, whenever we, when you use the, um, whenever you use the physics mod for the snow, you gotta drive like in real life. So you have to go like 25, 30 miles an hour. Um, and a lot of people don't really enjoy watching that. It takes a very long time to get places when you're only doing like 30 miles an hour because you can't go any faster because of the conditions. Hey, we made it to Denver. This will probably be a big lag show too, but we'll see. Big cities are rough. Finally we get around that guy. Jeez. He's slowing everybody up. No problem, Trev Chirukin. Good to see you as well. The stadium. Dude, please pick a lane and choose it. I didn't get to do very much Montana, man. Uh, when Montana came out, it's right when I moved. So I'm excited to go to Montana. Still have a lot left to explore there. Yeah, it feels just like Denver. Very cool, man. Headed towards Fort Collins. Get back home in uh, Missouri. Oh, I love it. I think I would. I didn't think I'd miss uh, uh, the seasons that much, but man, what a difference that is living in seasons. Miss Florida even a little bit, man. Nope. Did everything I ever wanted to do down there. Oh, it's nice. 
Yeah, I wonder what's causing the green, uh, greenish looking snow. Might be the uh, JBX vegetation. Might have to pull that out. I don't know. Somebody's overriding something. Yep, back in Missouri. Been back in Missouri since July. Gotta be a way to get rid of it. How do I stop this auto pop up menu? It I, I just I don't like it. Difficulty. Route advisor hidden. Oh. There it is. Thank you. Oh. Oh, that's so much better. Thank you. I don't have to deal with that crap anymore. Although for this one, we hit. We already did it. Did we not? Yep, we're green. I use uh, CIPH SIPS uh, traffic density mod for 1.46. It's really good. Keep it left. Don't you worry about it. Uh, Florida has beautiful weather, but um, it's something about having that weather all the time. Like, you, you do get the winter, like, you know, month and stuff like that that happens uh, sometimes. But the summers can be brutal. That's for certain. Oh, now I have pink snow. Interesting. Yeah, I don't, it's got to be the vegetation doing that. But I don't know. Because it's only some of the spots that are doing it. It's not all of it, you know. Hey, welcome to Wyoming, everybody.
Yeah, and then it goes away, so I, it could just be a Colorado thing. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, damn. There's a crash. No. It's just people not merging. Hey, we got the green. We don't have to go in. Woohoo! We hit just stopped too, so it's perfect. All right, we're outside of Cheyenne. Hmm. Still getting that pink snow, and the green is coming through still. It might need to go higher than the vegetation to do that properly. See if it gets any better. If it doesn't, we can try uh, adjusting it. Skip there. Keep left. still doing it so let's see if we can fix it it's a good place to check it because we can see how pink it is right there Let's try. Let's see if we can fix it. All right. So, skies, uh, prefabs, weather. See, it's above the base. Skybox, prefabs. Weather and start. Huh. I don't know. Maybe it needs to be higher than these rest of these. Try it. Let's try that. These are supposed to be way down there. Why did that even get screwed up? Okay. Let's see how that works. Yeah, Reefer Sound add-on. Pretty cool. It's on the uh, Steam Workshop. Let's see we got rid of the pink snow. fixed it that's what it was it looks much better no it's still green it's 
not as pronounced, though, is, is it? Looks more like slush. And something happened with the graphics, for sure. I don't know. Something seems weird, doesn't it? We'll give it a shot. Yeah, this is, this is how it's supposed to be. Because it's overriding a lot of the JBX stuff. Like Bloom and all that stuff's on. Not sure how I feel about the Bloom. Yeah, I think it's better though. For winter weather, you know. We got rid of the pink. I mean, the brown makes sense because it's supposed to, they're trying to like make it like the slush, you know, on the side of the road. With all the dirt and crap in it. You know, what a wonder. One, check something. That bloom is on. Do they even have a bloom on here? I don't think so. I think you can turn off the bloom. Nope. This thing needs some love, man. The uh, winter weather mod just adds a little bloom to everything, but that's that's okay. We, we'll live with it. Oh, that broke that. Interesting. Engine brakes now reversed. <laughs> Why? Oh well. I also noticed moving the snow up like that. Well, see, it's still doing the pink stuff a little bit. It's not near as bad, though. But moving it up higher on the priority seemed to help the frame rates out, too, with that. Yeah, you can turn on icy roads and all that stuff, but we're not going to do that. G Bloom off. Or G Bloom zero. Try it. See if we get this thing straight. Uh oh. Jesus. This is why you don't mess with this stuff, dude, in the middle of when you're doing all this. This game really hates having to open that console and put it back. I got rid of the bloom, though. Looks way better. We almost died doing it. I know, the menu resets the freaking Jake break. It's so annoying, man. Very annoying. Try it. They've got to fix a lot of these problems, man. There we go. Thank you. Yeah, we almost died. But we're okay. That's what happens when you mess with stuff in the uh, in the console. It's part of it. But yeah, that looks way better with the bloom turned off now. It doesn't look doesn't have that weird thing to it. We're still getting the pink and the greens though. It's 
So I don't think, I don't think that mattered at all. It was just coincidence. Oh, there's only so much you can do, you know? Why are you slamming the friggin' brakes, man? I get you're getting off the highway, but geez, roll off of it. A little earlier. This is where the fatigue is starting to, to, to set in from we've been driving so long. This is what does it. Yeah, I've played ATR or ATS in VR many, many times. I absolutely love it. Yeah, that's what I'm usually doing in ATS. Ruffles van. I really hope that they add seasons to the game one day. That would help out so much to have this natively in there, you know? still looks better in this load order but we'll have to see evo take care of yourself thanks for hanging out with us i don't know some people think that suspensions are too soft and they're too stiff i, I turn i turn the truck stability down so it has a roll to it otherwise it's like a rock and not like a chevy Hey, it's Casper. To me, every truck I've ever seen in my life moves around quite a bit. The cap does. The FLD mod is on the Steam Workshop. If you just look up FLD 120, it'll pop right up. It's the first one. It's like CGO. Let's see who makes it. It doesn't say like it's directly compatible for 146, but it is. It works. It works fine. the uh those tires that looks cool the salt on it road salt on them oh the map is huge man they're constantly adding states it's pretty crazy keep right and then turn right it's our exit What a crappy exit. Get ready to turn left.
to be right again. I'll watch this car, though. I don't trust them. Yep, that's why I didn't merge. I knew they were going to do that. Hey Bronco, take care of yourself. Thanks for hanging out. Happy New Year to you. I hope you have a good week. Keep right and then exit right. Exit right. Guys, we're not going to have a whole conversation about where every mod comes from. Um, there's, you can just Google it. Literally Google any mod you can think of um, on my YouTube channel uh, I, at the end of my videos I try to as many times as possible go over what mods I'm running so people can Google them and find them on their own I don't support any of the websites that run all of this stuff and oh, I, like I can't there's just no way um, and Steam Workshop if you don't know what you're doing with mods go to the Steam Workshop it's the best best bet that's what I would recommend this truck's on the Steam Workshop. If you want the winter weather mod, you have to go to Grimes WordPress for it. But all you have to do is go to the SES forums. And on the SES forums, you'll find everything you need. But Google, literally Google, that's all. That's how I do it. And there's no special place I go to to get all mods and things like that. Like I, I literally Google it. If I'm like, oh, I want to look, or I, wanna, I want this or this, I'll just search for it. And there's a lot of other um, uh, YouTube videos, people that show case the, the mods that are out there, and they usually link them and things like that. So there's all sorts of that stuff, man. Uh, Powder River. 45 here. Sound mods I'm using. There's free options out there, but I use Z mods. It's payware. All sorts of them. All right, Infinite. Infinite, take care. Hey, Jay. Wow, good to see you. Happy New Year to you. Hope you're doing well. Uh, the CV works, yes. If you want to hook it up that uh, to the audio, you can. Or you can use it just to click the button in. But yes, it, it's a full working CV. It's a real one, too. It's an A-Static. Crash the damn truck trying to put my CV back on its thing. Jesus. There we go. <laughs> Elite, what's up? How you doing tonight? Eric, it, it's always been a, a, pro, a part of the ATS streams, man. Um, but we, we've got to start like putting a stop to it because then it, that's just that's all it is. And then nobody uh, can get, you know, two cents in because we're getting the same questions asked over and over about mods. I'm into that place right there on the right. Not in real life, but in this game many, many times. <laughs> I stopped at that rest area. My monitor's a monitor. It's uh, on a monitor stand. It's a 48-inch monitor by Aorus. It's the 48 F O U something something. Something like that. We're stuck on this slowpoke. Hey SpongeBob, what's up? 
go straight. Highland. So we are outside of Shoshone. It looks like here in Wyoming. Gotcha. Yeah, no, it's it's just a forty-eight inch monitor. This guy in this truck is slamming the brakes over and over again. in their brakes today. For like no reason. Snow is a mod, yes. Grimes WordPress. If you just look up ATS snow mod, it'll pop up. It's the, it's the frosty winter weather mod. And read, for the love of God, read the readmes if you wanted to get it to work right. You'll need that. I'm doing good, Elite. Doing good. It's the uh, Lady Legend song. Right. All of her uh, her videos for the hunter stuff uses this song. I don't know the ETA. We'll get there when we get there. Watch some stream, not for a while, man. Uh, I just finished this whole rig, this whole setup. So next is the uh, is the flight sim rig. Working on that next. I'm just like out of friggin' steam, man. This one, this one took forever to do, but it's so worth it. I'm so happy I, it's here and I can use it. technical spot here going down this hill just a little bit Thermopolis welcomes you. 
And there's a Mexican restaurant right there. Oh, that sounds so good. It really does. Go straight. We'll go straight. Tight streets. Holy crap. Go straight. Joe Blanco, 43 months. Good to see you. How you doing? This is definitely going to be our last, like, run because, oh, my God, I'm feeling the fatigue of driving this for this long. We've been driving for three hours and 47 minutes. Well, not for this uh, particular drive, but we drove across Texas a lot. Come on, go into gear. Thank you. Jeez, Louise. Sharp corners in this game are like, I don't know. For some reason, they're just like overly sharp. Kind of a pain in the ass to deal with. Not at all. I'd be an excellent Uber driver if I was one. I don't rely on GPS. I know uh, all this, the city that I live in. That's like a start. Oh, we got that beautiful. Yeah, see, when we brought that higher on the on the list, we get these beautiful winter skies. Part of the mod, which is really cool. Driving an American truck sim and driving a real car is a total, two total different things. And then a live chat as well. It's all, it's just very different. These are, those are always, uh, when I do these live streams of American truck sim, it's such a blur. And I don't even realize, like, I don't even get, I don't even get to really sightsee very much in the game. I miss out on a lot of what the game is doing because of it. Um, when I just play by myself, I can, I really, I, you see everything and you're so immersed. I usually just listen to music and chill. It's like my chill out game. That's what I did before, uh, I went live. So I got some trucking in a couple hours in before then. Get on up the hill. Filler, what's up? How you doing? Oh, we're slamming brakes, aren't we? Yeah, we are. What's this thing doing? Come on, get into gear. Slam the brakes on you so hard. I don't know why he did that.
Here we can turn the uh, truck stability up a little bit. I usually start with it all the way down and then bring it up slightly. Until you get fine taste, fine tune it to taste. That's what I'm at. You and Jay did 109 planes with our sim at LaGuardia. Nice stopple. How about that was fun? I saw that uh, Paul uh, finally got it all together. So I'll have to play with you guys soon. That'd be fun. Go straight. Yeah, multiplayer can be a little buggy. Keep right, and then turn right. Turn right. Getting close to Montana. Motox, I had a great Christmas and New Year's. Hopefully, you did as well. tight turn here see anything screw it we're just gonna bright everybody I can't see anything out here so, oh well Adam, 688, what is going on? How you doing? Bum, bum, uh, Friday, 7 p.m. Estia, PG. Glad to hear it, Adam.
Both straight. Go straight. Okay, that land ended. Right, it's quite a end right here. On the road again. Beef Taco Supreme, what is going on? Thanks for the raid, bud. Welcome on in. Port of entry, half a mile. I'm sure we'll stop for that. Nope, we have to bypass it. Hell yeah. I left it all. <coughs> Keep right and then go straight. Go straight. Go straight. C22, what's up? How you doing? Happy New Year to you as well. Hope you had a great one. go into that gear. It's 13 speed throw me off, man. Nothing like the 18. Well, I mean, kind of like 18, but not really. Oh, my God. Right. Well, we got to be getting close to Montana now, so. It's only 112 to Billings, I saw there, so. I should tell you. Right there. I gotta turn my blacks up on this uh, on this monitor. It's it's really dark. It's like pitch black out right now for me. Like I look over at the monitor on the left and see the skyline. I can't even see the skyline, or I or I see those things, but I just see the white light on them. It's like barely. We're getting on Highway 90. So we're in Laurel? Where we're at? Uh, yep, Laurel. There you go. Still have 146 miles to go.
not going into gear. Come on now. It's doing that same thing it was doing earlier. Why are you doing that? Come on. It's like not remembering the the damn uh, range selector. Very weird. I I'm just getting tired of doing it. <laughs> There's always that. I'm like forgetting what gear it's in. But that doesn't make any sense. We just took off from the thing. But th it didn't seem like I like it registered it when I did that. Thank you, car. We're letting us on the highway, barely. having issues with it okay I'm not the only one strange it's like it like does the thing that it does for like if you open up a menu you know what I mean it, it forgets where you're at in the game it's no big deal it's just kind of annoying to deal with sometimes going real slow. <laughs> Why does it bother people for, for the engine needle to get close to 2,000 RPM? When you're going up hills and stuff like that, you're trying to get everything you can out of the engine. If you just shift down to 1,500, you're going to lose so much momentum. I shift around at 1800 or so, but I mean, it's, it's not bad to go to 2000 RPM. I don't know why a lot of people think that that is the case. climbing a mountain right now, so we're getting everything we can out of her. And we only have 435 horsepower in this thing, so you want to have, uh, you want to have as much momentum as possible for these mountains. Otherwise you get stuck on a hill, and that's no fun. Nobody wants that. What goes up must come down. Doing that as well. It's so friggin' black out here. Holy moly. I turned the brightness up on the monitor so bad. And these headlights suck. see something again. Holy crap. Da -da -da -da. Yeah, Eric. I, 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 
what I was basically saying was that it never fails. Like we, we, you could drive the truck properly the entire stream, and then if you do one little thing where you like you go 2,000 RPM over, that's whenever people are like, why do you do that, or why are you revving that so hard, or why are you? It's like, man, I don't know. <laughs> it's. It doesn't matter. Same thing happens in flight sim too. You do everything right, and then you do one thing wrong, and then it's the it's your head. It's like it's a sim. We're having fun, man. This is gonna be a crazy. It's so it's so dark. I can't see. But I gotta turn up the brightness. Hey, Bozeman! Look at that! Look at that! Holy moly! What a drive, man. Yeah, my patience with that stuff starts to go out the window, especially when we've been doing this as long. We've, we've been going for four hours. I usually only stream for like two. Okay, so not this egg set of exits. It'll be the next one. But I knew when we signed up to go to Bozeman, I was like, man, this is going to be a drive. It is, it is. Right on the money with uh, with fuel too. We only had to make one fuel stop. That was it. A doodle 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 doodle. Turn here and towards the city turn center. Left. Got a lot of use out of this FLD, man. I really enjoyed driving it. Turn left. It's awesome. Down low on that guy, we're good. Go straight. Oh man, the snow up here looks really, really cool. Not bad at all. Yeah, I guess just. Just Dave, I can't do that. Like, I would not have a uh, entire setup like this just to be driving like a jackass all the time. You know what I mean? Holy moly, man! I'm definitely feeling it from this run. There's Texas Roadhouse. That looks good too. I'm just, I think I'm just getting hungry. Yep, talk powder, Captain Jack. 100. percent Mitchell, one, two, three, four, five, five. Hello to you. How you doing? Bum, 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 bum. Oh. Here's my my monitor uh, remote fell off somewhere around here. Because I'm going to be turning up that, these dark shadows. It's like, it, I mean, it's just completely pitch black. Everywhere you think that there's a shadow. Yeah. Keep right. And then turn we'll, right. We'll fix that. All right, this is where we're going right here. General Mills. Turn right. Okay. You have arrived at your destination. 
back on the left. Holy crap, we made it, folks. Roll these windows down. Whew. Uh, Redneck Bubba, I uh, stream Monday through Friday, whenever I possibly can, uh, and usually right in the evening time, right around 8 p.m. Central Standard Time. It can change from time to time, but that's what we try to shoot for around here. Okay, which one are we going to? Oh, that one right there? Nice. All right, we get a straight back. You gotta be kidding me here. Bad at all. Well, as straight as we possibly can. Straight as it'll allow. We don't belong here. I want more out of there we go. It's been right on around. Well, they usually don't give you enough room here for a straight back. It's always gonna be a blind. But we try the best we can to prevent it from doing it. Had a great New Year's, uh, Carp. We did, uh... Hey, we're in the dock. Nice. Nailed that one. Oh yeah, we nailed that back. Could have gone any more, any better than that. One thousand eight hundred and two miles, forty-six hours, one minute, four hundred twenty-eight point five gallons of fuel consumed. Wow. That was a $77,000 run. Talc powder from Laredo, Texas to Bozeman, Montana, dude. How crazy is that? It's pretty damn good. That was one hell of a trip, man. 
That was a lot of fun. Tanner VR, thank you for the four months. Appreciate you. Spade, 216, five months. Thank you so much. And, uh, yeah, we only have one, uh, one rule here on this channel, and that is, you know, respect for the others. And when you're spamming or you're saying stupid stuff that, and you're not going to get responses out of anybody, you got to learn to read the room there. I, I hate coming down on people like that. I really do. Um, but sometimes we just have to do it. So I do appreciate all of you for hanging out. I had a great time. Remember how we said we were going to Texas Roadhouse? Oh, we're going there. We are going to go there. Little lettuce. That's just it. Texas Roadhouse is not a Florida thing. We have one right here in St. Louis. They're all over the place. Into the fire. can. I don't think we can go into this hotel. Will they let you? I think it's all going to be closed off. We get a room. Looks like they're letting us go in here. Interesting. I like whenever they give us more freedom to like see everything. tour buses there's absolutely zero reason for me to uh, become a truck driver zero reasons so no it's not in the cards over here we can go to. She's a uh, sports car, man, whenever you don't have a trail on the back of it. It's up and goes. The truck is on Steam, yes. It is the FLD 120. All 50 states have Texas Roadhouses. Yep, that sounds about right. Well, congratulations, Sphinx. Finally going to be uh, Sphinx. You're going to be retiring from trucking. So hats off to you, man. But you know what? You'll you'll miss you'll miss it uh, some of it, and you'll uh, want to play like a mega truck sim. That's what a lot of guys do. The button box, yeah, you can get it on atsaccessories.com. It's the Patriot XL. But you can't have that one, sorry. I love it too much. There's the garage across the street from the Exxon. That's good on you, man. Well, congratulations. That's cool. What a great truck, man. This FLD was awesome to drive. Halfway across the damn United States.
Woohoo! Hell of a trip. But yeah, I need to get money up on my other profile so I can at least get um, an engine sound in it. Once I get, I can just put a Z mod engine sound in one of the uh, trucks, then I'll be happy. And then we can start doing that, you know. Uh, I don't do Truckers MP. No. It's not for me. I like Convoy because you have the AI traffic and you can have a, a convoy of some people, but no, not Truckers MP. And the. Uh, <laughs> you think uh, you think admins are, back on, are, are bad on uh, GTA 5 RP, man? Oof. What can you say about some of the stuff I've seen on that? Absolutely. Aramaris. Aramaris. Appreciate you all hanging out with me on this now Monday, but it was Sunday the first. Woo. Had a blast. Long drive. Four hours and 23 minutes of being on the stream driving. Woo. We did it tonight. A lot of miles logged. Old Sarge, thanks for that raid and everybody that showed up. I missed that part of it. Sorry. But there you go. Um, is, yep. There you go, guys. That'll do it for us. I don't have any, like, flashy ending or anything like that. Is anybody live right now we can raid? There might be. There might be somebody we can raid. You just wait and see. We'll see if there is. Nobody's really playing anything right now. That's all right. We tried. That's all that matters. All right, guys. Love you all. Thank you. Bye-bye.